So I'm sitting here killing some Novas. And this is to go even further beyond! And I thought this would be a good time for me to show you guys some of my current build as of right now for both my characters. It's been a long time since I gave an update. So let's go ahead and give you guys what I have so far. So, this is my assassin. Not this build, this is my main one right here. Very, very standard build. Double um, dual blades, double Osiris stackers, Eclipse stacker, metal, not metal mandra, um, clan mandra. Basic build up, divine armor and gloves, and lunar stuff. Very, very basic. And here's my loadout for my support weapons. Stacking all percent, make sure I have good crit. Um, sometimes these weapons aren't dark because I like to stack this pure stats. And as of right now, I'm already damage cap at 61,000 and uh, no, 61,000, 16,000 and 100 dark. So that's plenty of neat. I just need HP right now and a crit, so I am good to go there. Armor, basic stuff. I stack HP, dark, very, very basic stuff. You guys understand here. And here's my support stacking crit and dark as well. Very, very basic stuff. Now, the question is what will I do with my samurai as of right now? Well, I have. 1,584 gems save up as of right now. I could be going for the Goddess series for my Assassin and Prison as well. Not sure when they come out because they're pretty recent in Jap Japanese server. So I may get them or I may not get them. I'm looking into going to Desperado because uh, Spoons are pretty OP in that game. Um, basically, I want to become a Desperado on my Assassin, get three Spoons and just basically whack everyone, become OP. So that's what I'm kind of saving up as of right now for Goddess and not using my gems on crappy lottos like the ones we have right now. So that's my game plan for my Assassin. Uh, basic build everything. I don't farm much anymore because I basically have everything I need and everything that's in here is just taking up space. I should be putting them in my inventory, but very lazy for that. So... Um, Things I stack, a lot of metals I farm, very, very basic stuff. I plan on turning my assassin into a Desperado one day, so that's why I'm holding on to gems and rolling for the Goddess series. A very, very OP series. And here is Akimo, my guardian slash bishop, or not, not bishop but anymore, Valkyrie, a support. Very, very basic builds. Um, main builds, stuff I use. Um, let's go to my tank first. I use this for most things. Uh, not this build particularly, I have 3 full metals here, I don't recommend using this often. My usual build has 2 um, tre trembling shivers, whatever you want to call them. Uh, this is just a basic build I use for like most things, swap your divine, you guys already know the drill. Uh, I make sure these, I don't really care too much, I should be leveling up these skills right here, but I'd rather have the passives. Um, HP from these skills are pretty nice, um, the skill power. This is why I don't like these because they're not a damage dealer. That's why I just level up third passive. I mean, not third passive, second passive. Hat is pretty good to have because of the HP. But again, it's only a marginal HP, so you don't really need it. That's why I put all my support in here. And that's my game plan. Uh, gear build, a lot of HP, a lot of defense. Armor, same thing, HP and defense. And that's basically how I play my Guardians. Stack a lot of these. Um, get res medals. I use angel sometimes pretty nice to use if you have marvel works gets that um, I don't use Marvel works because I don't farm it, but uh, it's somewhere over here. Where's it at? Uh, it's somewhere here don't know where but I Literally right here. So I'll use this if you have it pretty good as well for guardians and yeah, that's basically how I build my guardian now for my healer uh, different build. I use sometimes I use two QTs rather than uh, Living Guardian. Depends what I want to build. Valkyrie build already changes, so I'm not using the same thing. And how I build my Guardian, I build very, very tanky. See these stats right here? Very, 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 very tanky. Now, the reason for why, I've told you guys many times, tanky Valkyrie is the way to go. You don't want to die, you don't need to heal a lot, you just need to heal enough, and you need to survive. That's your main goal. You just want to tank and heal and survive. That's all you need to do as Valkyrie. Um, here's my build out for my support Valkyrie. A lot, a lot of Lance of Shields and Holy Swords. 
don't need much of anything else because my objective is to stack as much defense as possible. Element could be a little bit higher, but that's what I'm working on as of right now, trying to get a little bit more light just to make my life a little bit easier. But everything else is a very, very basic build. Nothing in particular that's very out there. Very straightforward tank Valkyrie build. Very, very good. So what I want to aim for my crystals at right now, I have 1,173, and I'm saving for Graham. Now, Graham is very, very unlikely to come to me because that thing is like trying to find a needle in a haystack. But I'm going to go for it. I'm going to give it a shot. Try my best to get one. If I do get a Graham, I'll be very, very happy. But if I don't get one, then I'll just settle with it. And we'll just keep playing the game from there. So that's my basic builds for my supports. Valkyrie and Guardian, very, very tanky builds. How I recommend most players to get them. And, yep, that's basically it, guys. Thank you all for watching. That's my update for my characters as of right now. So, thank you all for watching. Hopefully, you guys found that entertaining to watch. And back to farming in JP. So, deuces, guys.